Okay, here's a really quick short tier. Uh. Okay, here's a really quick short tutorial on how to use SharePod. This program gets music off of your iPod for free. Go to getsharepod.com slash download. That's getsharepod.com slash download. When you get there, click the download button. It's off to the right. Don't know if you can see it on my screen. Um, you got to have WinZip or WinRAR. Uh, these two websites with the program will be posted in the notes off to the side. Click open. And when it opens, copy the file sharepod.exe onto the desktop. Just drag it there. And you see that over there? Sharepod. I believe, yeah, Sharepod. Okay. After you have done that, connect your iPod and make sure it's recognized by iTunes. See over here, we have my iPod. Okay. Now what you want to do is right here, uh, make sure enable disk use is checked. I don't remember how to do that, so if you Google enable disk use for iPod or something similar, it should come up, but just make sure it's checked. Go over to my computer and locate your iPod. Mine is Steven's IP at drive A. See that there? Double click on it to open it. And there should be some files, probably not as many as mine. Now, drag the SharePod from your desktop onto this window so that it's copied onto your iPod. Now, mine says uh, copy and replace or whatever because I already have it on there. After you do that, double click on it to run the program. Okay, SharePod comes up. Real simple to use. First icons copy to PC, next one's copy to iPod. And then you have your iPod and your playlists, if you have any on the left hand side. If you click where it says playlists at the top here, you can do playlists, find tracks, and media player. Um, a lot of people don't have their music by playlist, so I'm going to show you how to do it without that. If you would like to copy everything that you have, make sure the first song is selected and then scroll all the way to the bottom of your music and hold the shift key and click notice that it all turns blue after you do this I'm only going to show you with a couple songs because I've already done this after you do this select copy to PC a window will pop up and in this top part right here it says copy tracks to my computer uh, click the three dots and I recommend you choose desktop um, it may not show desktop so you'll have to go to um, local disk C or C drive whatever your regular drive is go down to users um, select your name and desktop 
After you've done that, click Make New Folder and label it whatever you want. Everything here is 40 below summer, so I'm going to select that. Uh, I mean, I'm going to type that. And press Enter. And you'll see that that folder is selected. Click OK. And if you take a look, that's what mine looks like. The bottom um, is how you want the titles to appear. I like track number and then title. You don't have to do it that way, but that's what's used by a lot of things. You can select whatever's there. After you do that, click OK. And another window pops up and it shows you that it's copying the songs. It tells you which song it's copying. And when it finishes, it says copy finished at the bottom. And if you go to where you created that folder, right here, you'll see all your music. And that concludes this tutorial for how to use SharePod.